Hello, I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com. In this video, I'll show you how to remove unwanted sounds from audio using the Spot Healing Brush Tool in Adobe Audition. So let's hop into Adobe Audition. And first, before I get started, let me tell you about my online courses that are open for enrollment now, and you can do so at mrc.fm forward slash learn. If you want to learn about audio production, podcast production, or sounding great on a live stream, head over to mrc.fm forward slash learn and get started now. Let's hop into Adobe Audition and here's some audio. Let's play it. But they haven't really thought it through. So anyway. Yeah, definitely a parrot going on there in the background. Now this could be used for anything. Just think of the annoying sounds like whistles or ship's horns or anything else that could appear when you're trying to be heard or you've got some dialogue that you want to be heard, uh, not those background noises. You can't really see the parrot, but through. even though it's there anyway. and there, uh, but you can't see it here in the standard waveform view. This is where you need to go into the ninja view of Adobe Audition and switch on spectral frequency display. This is accessed using this icon up here, or you can hit Shift and D on your keyboard and you get this like heat map of frequencies. It's really easy to see now that there is a parrot here. Can you see that? And there's also a parrot here. Now I can hear that if I actually use the paintbrush tool up here and I paint over the selection of just the parrot itself. There we go. And I play just that audio. There is the isolated parrot. Okay, that's how you isolate a parrot in, in all this speech. Play it in context. Anyway. Anyway. Uh, and then we go over to this, the spectral, uh, sorry, the spot healing brush tool that we use in the spectral frequency view. Uh, and you'll see here, this is nice and big, but I can make it smaller using the curly brackets up and down like so until it's just big enough to really cover over that parrot sound. Okay, do the first one. It's pretty much gone. I might do two or it's advisable to even consider doing three passes here until you've got rid of it. Anyway. Now you can still hear there's a still there's a little squeaky ew at the top there. Anyway, hasn't completely gone. That's because can you see there's a little harmonic up here? Really easy to spot in spectral frequency using curly brackets to tighten around this and go down. Let's have a listen. Anyway, there anyway. we go. And that's about as good as we're going to get it. Let's listen to the original. But they haven't really thought it through. So anyway. And there in the second take, you can hear it's almost completely gone. So many things you can remove using the Spot Healing Brush Tool. It's kind of like the Photoshop of audio. I highly recommend it when you've got annoying sounds that are intermittent in the background. Could be anything, could be crickets buzzing away. Uh, you let me know what you've used the Spot Healing Brush Tool on in the comments down below. 